Welcome back. For folks in Framingham, most have heard of the Swell family and the devastating diagnosis for their youngest son, Devin, who has a rare type of cancer called DIPG in his brainstem. The community has supported the family by raising awareness of this type of cancer. With that in mind, today's guest is Vla Vladimir Gitterman, mm -hmm. organizer of the New England Ride for Kids, a motorcycle ride to benefit the Pediatric Brain Tumor Foundation. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you for having me. And just to be clear, the Ride for Kids is not a fundraiser for the Swell family, mm -hmm. but for all kids who are going through this battle. Yeah. So can you start by telling us what the Ride for Kids is? Uh, ride for Kids is a motorcycle, uh, motorcycle ride. It's a national event. We're going to have 33 rides across the country, and one of them happens here in uh, Framingham. Um, our ride is on August 27th. Um, uh, we start at 8 o'clock, uh, registration 8 to 9.30, and we, uh, we do some family activities, and we go on a motorcycle ride uh, through local towns, and then come back to uh, Bowes in Framingham and you know, have a little bit of fun. I was gonna make sure, I wanted to make sure you added that it, it starts and finishes at Bowes Mountain, which is a pretty cool location. Yes, absolutely. We uh, moved, our ride moved to Bowes uh, four years ago, and they've been a wonderful host for us. Uh, can you tell us how the families benefit from the foundation? So um, the families, they, we, we started uh, three or four years ago, we started a family support program in addition to our research program through the Pediatric Brain Tumor Foundation. Um, so families can, uh, uh, we do financial support through our butterfly fund. Um, we do uh, family support if, you know, if parents need to talk to someone or, um, you know, even uh, even some doctor's advice, and we have a star folio that basically tells families what to do, what questions to ask the doctors when they um, when the kids getting the diagnosis of a brain tumor. And what's this year's goal? This year, uh, our goal fundraising goal is sixty thousand dollars, which is twenty thousand dollars more than last year. So, so your goal last year was 40000 but you raised? We raised fifty two, and uh, so this year's goal is 60000 yes. I <laughs> you every year. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, how did you get involved? Uh, I got involved through, I'm a motorcyclist, a motorcycle rider, and um, I like to do charity rides, and um, I was just uh, sitting one day, Saturday afternoon, just looking for a ride for Sunday, and I found the uh, Pediatric Brain Tumor Foundation's uh, ride for kids, and I joined them and uh, started volunteering, and now I'm task force leader for the New England Ride for Kids. How many years has it been? Four years, I want to say. <laughs> it's either four or five. And can you give us a, um, one of your favorite memories from this ride? Uh, my f favorite memories from the ride is I always I look around and I see kids that are affected with brain tumors. We we welcome what we call star families uh, to our event, and those are the kids and their brothers and sisters and parents and grandparents. And uh, my favorite moment when I look around and I see the kids and their families smile. This is my this mission achieved for me. You know, I mean, then at the end of the day, then we make sure that we, we get our fundraising goal. But during the event, this is like I see all the smiles and that that makes my day. So people who don't motorcycle ride, mm -hmm. um, how can they get involved? Uh, they can get involved by volunteering um, or they can just show up and check out all the cool motorcycles. And we have a lot of activities uh, on the day off. We have face painters, balloon artists. We have, you know, just kind of plenty of opportunities to take nice pictures. Superheroes this year, um, so yeah. And how can people sign up? So the easiest way is to go to uh, Facebook uh, and join our Facebook page at uh, New England Right for Kids. Uh, and all the information is in there. You can message us through the page. This would be the easiest way to get in touch with us. How is this year gonna be different than previous years? Um, 
we are going to have more families um, this year, uh, which is which is always cool. We are going to just a f just a little a few surprises this year as well. We are, because we are, we're grown from two years ago having only 70 motorcycles. Last year we're gonna we had 400. This year we're going to have even more. With that we changing our site plan and just introducing a couple of uh, new things to the riders. You know. Riders just have to show up and see. <laughs> Excellent. Well, thank you so much for coming in. Thank you. Thank you for having me. And if you'll wait right there, the Framingham Beat will be right back.